what is up guys, Lobotomus here, and today we're going to be playing a game called The Lion Song, Episode 1. This seems like a new game, and um, guys, I'm also sorry about not uploading for like ever, you know, things are coming up, I have life too. You all are probably very, very surprised by that. I tried to record this um, once, it's been like two weeks actually since I record recorded anything. But, sorry, now I'm back, This uh, I'm gonna try to do this in like a two-part, three-part, whatever, uh, this is, I played it a little bit, but not that much, it's a story-based game, so yeah, let's get into it, so I'm gonna restart it, attention, uh, restart episode, yeah, start it, okay, so I'm gonna be acting like new, it's a pixel game sort of milk train station do you have enough socks you need plenty of socks it's very cold out there mama you packed the suitcase yourself it's stuffed with socks <laughs> all aboard all aboard for the for vienna ah isn't that from shakespeare like vienna uh shakespeare's play romeo and juliet oh, i don't know maybe it is maybe it isn't you will write to your mother won't you Every day, Papa, I promise. Papa, I promise. You're such a liar, but I love you anyway. All aboard. <laughs> Last call to Vienna. Mama, let the boy go. He will get in trouble if he's late. My dear boy, take care, take care. I'm gonna stop trying to do like... So is that us? Yes, Mama and Papa. You take care too. Take care. Wilma first left left them on the very this very station. Now me. Wilma. Oh yeah, this is that. Okay, I'm not gonna spoil it for you. All. It's her. That's Wilma. Whatever that was. Myself. That's Wilma. Author's desk. Myself. Author, where are you? You asked to come to your office. Here I am, waiting. Maybe at last you want to talk about us? What's going on between you guys? But you're so shy, Arthur. Arthur. I thought it said author. Oh, Arthur. You should know. Uh, you should know how to begin. Oh, don't be silly, Wilma. You're hoping it will happen. What will happen? But it never will. What? Are, what's happening? I'm glad you're here. I just had I'm just had to see you. See old, so it's not a relationship thing. Sorry I'm late. Um I haven't been waiting long. I don't want to be rude. Well to be quite honest, yes. Wilma, your performance at the salon, it was quite incredible. The guests could not believe their ears. Oh yeah, see, they seem to enjoy the music. You all should hear me sing. I'm beautiful. <laughs> uh, they want to hear more from you, Wilma. We need to keep up the momentum. How's the new composition coming along? I'm progressing. Your music is so new. Oh, <laughs> is she rapping? I'm pretty sure that'd be new at like that time stage time period <laughs> she's like see motherfuckers <laughs> okay I'm not even gonna start it entices yep rapping does entice it challenges I think no I know that we are uh, that we are about to achieve something great here she's the next Beyonce <laughs> uh, the uh, the future of music Arthur I'm um, we must build on on the success of your performances. If we stop, you will squander with this opportunity. We have to keep moving. Keep working. We have to establish your name. <laughs> so it is basically, um... What do you call it? Ah, I forgot it. Uh, she, so she basically is rapping. I'm kidding. <laughs> we have to establish your name. It's like Disney. And how he like forced everyone to work. Yeah. Well, I'm that is what is it? 
I'm started I've started composing it by by Oh Arthur, I'm stuck. I'm horribly, horribly stuck. I don't know how to complete it. Wilma, don't say that. We've come so far. Rapping is basically a bunch of gibberish anyway, so I'm like what's what's there to complete? Everything we've worked for. I can't bear to let you down. I know what's wrong. It's pressure from the institute. Every everyone claiming of you for your intention. Recognizing you on the street. And even more pressure from me. Yeah, give her a break. Let her go to Hawaii. Or airplane or airplanes invented yet. Well, trains were invented, so I think airplanes were invented. I think. Uh Vienna is a city, we can't change that. You said it yourself, it's momentum. You need to change. you need to change, that's clear. Listen, I have to I have a cabin in the mountains. You'll you will be able to work there. In the mountains. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Let's work in the mountains. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, would you come with me? I that would hardly help your reputation. Yeah, you're pretty annoying. You need time alone. The quiet. Yes, quiet. I'd be afraid to go into the mountains by myself, honestly. Yes. Um, I'll take care of things here. Arthur, I can't. I'm not asking. It's settled. He, he's like Disney. It's like now or now. <laughs> get, get GTFO. A carriage will pick you up tomorrow. There are plenty, plenty of supplies in the cabin. Um, guys, hold up. Let me just... Oh, the lighting is so much better this way. Uh, there's a lamp right there. So, you going to the cabin yet? Have you all seen the movie, The Cabin? That's a pretty good movie. It's stupid, but it's pretty good. Pack lightly. You're not bringing the old violin, are you? Of course I am. Playing the, the old violin is relaxes me. So, uh, what is it? Violin rap? <laughs> You'll have to walk the last part of the way. It's quite a hike. I'll manage. Very well, I do think th this is for the best. You will be completely no alone. No distractions. That is scary, bruh. I feel like zombies just like come all around. Somewhere in the Alps. The Alps! The forest. Almost there. Just a little bit further, further, not further. Just a few more steps. Phew. I finally arrived. That's it, Arthur's cabin. Oh, Arthur, I hope so much that you are right. You're right, not you are. And inspiration is waiting for me down there. <laughs> what, that piece of wood in the corner? Oh, is this moving without me knowing? I'm so sorry, guys. Inspiration. Forest. The forest up here is so dense. The trees are thick with needles. Oh, you can almost see nothing through. Okay, so... She's repeat. Waiting for something. The wind is growing stronger. I won't be long until the storm is here. I'd better hurry. So just like go up there. Oh, this sounds so much like so much like the Dark Souls soundtrack. Like when you're just walking around. Oh my gosh, this brings back memories. Uh, the first time I played Dark Souls, that was amazing. I usually play my games without sound. Actually, I just look at them. I made it just before the rain. Hopefully it will stop soon. Okay. The walk up here was exhausting. <laughs> I'm, I'm so sorry. Phew. Alright, Wilma. It's time to unpack your bag. It started to rain. Okay, where's your bag? Where's your bag? 
Okay, it started to rain. How long will it continue? But oh, the telephone. I should unpack first. Ton tonal diversity, by Professor Arthur Coban. I didn't know he had written a book. Locked. Um. Well, where's your bag? A uh, poetry book. There are s there are several several poems in it. Okay, Reich Hoff Hoffman stalls. L l I, I really can't read with pixel words. Um, and a few other authors. Let's see. Oh, uh, here it is. The Panther, Pink Panther. I will read it later. Mathematics, despite its similarity to music, I barely understand it. About transformations uh, named E. Sichel. Sir Emmett. The lamp casts a dim light. The flame dances quite to and fro and flares. What? And flares briefly before subsiding. Okay. Oh, myself. The materials... Luggage. What? It's still in my luggage. Where's your luggage? I'm like, could you get up? My bag. I'm starving. There should be a sandwich somewhere here. in here. Music paper. Why don't you actually pick it, pick it up? Oh, here it is. Oh, a uh, letter. Who's it from? Oh, I got an achievement. Yay, pack lightly. Uh, it says, open upon arrival. My dear Wilma, I hope you are, you had a trouble-free journey. I'm sure you have started writing already, inspired by the beautiful surroundings. Read on. However, I have a confession to make. A murder? <laughs> Perhaps he has written something about us. What, what about them? What's going? What's going on with them? that's so different before your departure I started to organize a concert at the Musique Kevrieren in Vienna so what is this like a Paris Paris I think I was able to convince a few illustration col colleagues to offer their works read on why well, send an option to read on just read on anyways I had to call in many favors but Mr. I'm not gonna read that. Mr. Berg and Mr. Mahler all have all agreed to participate and share their works for this glorious evening. Okay. Ah, it's like purge evening. Murder. And your composition will be at the centerpiece. And the grand finale. Wilma, imagine it. I understand. She's sad. She's sad for some reason. Why is she sad? I understand this this is all very abrupt but and for all that I apologize but now is your time the musician start rehearsal next week that the piece must be already ready by then oh so um, it's a rush for her in anticipation of your return Arthur a concert a one week how how is this less pressure? <laughs> Arthur, how could you? The storm is almost here. How am I supposed to write something if I can't go outside? I'm trapped here. It's only for one day. Like what is this storm gonna last last seven days? And within me silence. Take the phone. Take the phone. Take the phone. Hello. Hello. Isn't like H E. Uh, the Gen G E Tam Necto. What? Smoking's bad for you. Excuse me. Oh, German. Yes. Who's this? I um. Well. My name is Leos. Are you still there? 
Yes. Amazing. I wonder if you could... Are you close by? Where are you? Uh... Oh, <laughs> look at her face. Like <laughs> That ponage face. I'd rather not say. I want to keep this to myself. I am uh, in a different country. Or maybe even a different co continent. In a cloud. In a cloud. Aha. Uh -huh. I will never. How? Oh, that was the worst laugh ever for me. Ha ha. I'm like a robot. I'm a transformer if you didn't know that. I would never. L I would have dreamed. Uh, ah! I can't read. I never would have dreamed of this. I was able to. I. I was told you can speak over long distances, but to actually hear your voice, it's still amazing. It's amazing. There wasn't a stone there, but whatever. I can now finally talk to my niece, Nicole. Stomach rumble. What was that? <laughs> Did she fart? There's a storm here. That sounded a bit closer. How embarrassing. I hear I hear this noise every day. When my guests come to me with empty bellies. Are you enjoying are you an innkeeper, Leos? Why is that embarrassing to have your stomach rumble? I don't get it. People are weird. Are you an innkeeper, Lois? I am. But dumplings in all of Bohemia. Bohemia? Wonderful when they're um, fresh out the pot. Fresh out the pot. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, with a rich, hearty sauce. Stomach crumbling. And when you... And when you cut it into... Okay, so they're just talking about food right right now. Sounds delicious. They are delicious. Ah, okay. No, no, no. They're, they're just boring. Okay, so guys, um, they were just talking about food and stuff. So I, I just had to skip it. And that was just pure boringness, so there was nothing there. That was interesting. Okay, time for my sandwich. Stomach rumble. I'm, st I'm starving. Sandwich. Who eats like that? <laughs> Who makes a sound like that when they're eating? I, other than me. Munch. It tastes delicious. I am so tired. Uh, it's your first day, you're tired, okay. So, anyways guys, I'll see you all in the next episode. That's all the time we have for today. And I guess we'll resume next time from this point. But, I'm not gonna, like, it's not gonna be like part one of this and then next video part two. It's gonna, next, next, uh, my next video is probably gonna be something else. Not this, but something else because I don't wanna be like doing it over and over again so anyway see you later guys bye